I think the interesting thing about the recovery from heart valve surgery is that most patients and their caregivers don't think about it. What they think about is, I want to live through this procedure. I want to wake up with a normal functioning heart. So the concept of recovery, in my opinion, is one of the most overlooked aspects of this entire surgical process. And I know from personal experience that when you enter recovery, it again can be a situation much like a roller coaster. You, uh, sorry. No, that's good. Okay. Much like a roller coaster. Yeah. We can. Do you want me to just pick back up uh -huh. in terms of? Mm -hmm. Okay. So in my experience of recovery, there are certain milestones, certain checkpoints that tell you that you're on the right path. You can drive at three weeks. You can go back to work at six weeks. But those are just two things. How are you going to get in and out of bed? How are you going to open up the refrigerator when your chest has just had severe physical trauma to it? Um, what is it going to be like when you're alone and you're not in the hospital and your caregivers aren't around? The number of questions and the lack of planning that occur can occur for a patient is something that needs to be addressed. And this is why websites like here at the American Heart Association, my own website, we focus an extreme amount on making sure that a recovery plan is in place with appropriate milestones so that you know you are doing as best as you can at each step. Great.